choice to win, and yeah, then and he, kinda, kinda he got top layered. <laughs> yeah, he got top layered, and that'll <laughs> happen, man. It will happen. And of course, Chag, Chag, no stranger to MSM SoCal events, as you know, he's prime Palutena player. I know he's got a couple of secondaries he's been working on as well. Uh, I'm curious to see if we'll ever if we'll get to see those come out. But uh, I'd be surprised only because like you know Chag, even when he's down, he just always sticks it through. Especially in you remember the, the Smash World Tour, still play Palutena even though that you had it, there was a situation where he was down like 0-2 or 0-1, he mm -hmm. was tilted. Mm -hmm. Usually most players in that case will switch like okay I can't take this anymore, but finally he was able to like have resilience and just stay through. But I think I think we're all rooting for Chag to have a, a good run again. You know we know how good we know how good this player is. We know he's the best Palutena in Mexico. We know you know. He's yeah. capable of some pretty sick yeah, stuff. Yeah, definitely. I'm waiting for the next like national, international event just so we can see how good Chag will perform and where he's gonna place, you know, amongst the other top offline talent. And of course, you know, shout out to Chag's organization, Crime. Crime, uh, definitely putting in a lot of work in the community. Yeah, Crime, one of the honestly people who has put so much energy, time, and money into the community, and uh, I, 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 I can I can foresee some pretty cool stuff happening in the future. Oh, Thanks, cool. people like him. Sick, sick, sick. I, I look forward to it. But here we go. Game one, Crime Chag versus Nexus. Honestly, I, I'm expecting, like, just pure oppression from Chag, especially when it comes to the ledge play. Same. But, Falco, if you're going to play this character, it's all about those cutscene combos. You oh. cannot let down at all. If you have low percent grab, land some up airs. If you got to drag down there, land an up tilt. Everything leads to everything. The only thing preventing your continuation is your creativity. So That's make sure. That is very true, but at the same time, those higher percent, it's really going to be about the up tilt that we're going to see Nexus really fishing for because that's what's going to lead into like back air along with uh, some other options for, for Nexus to take the stock. Um, but we haven't really seen Nexus go for any up tilts, and I think with the way that Chegg is landing, it's going to be very difficult for him to land up tilt. Ooh, there's the up tilt. Here they come! Back air again. Oh! Ooh, lands the up smash. I like that a lot. Yeah, good bait coming from Nexus. I wasn't expecting him to like just illusion, not only back to the stage, but back back to the ledge, but back to the stage and cover the cover the teleport. That was sick. Yeah. Oh no! Uh, no, no. Oh, okay. Wow. <laughs> the magnet hands in this game are so forgiving. Magnet hands and just a slight mistiming from Chag. Yeah, Nexus looking Woo! poised, calm, and ready. Okay, resetting on the flat, on the ledge. Gaining some invulnerability, running out of the invulnerability that Nexus has. He's up tilts to back airs. I mean, this is what the gameplay that we're going to be seeing from from Nexus. Nair into Nair into Fair. Oh, oh. He's, he's not he is not letting down. He's not. I'm really surprised that we saw Chag like pretty much do the stare down in front of Nexus while he was taking. He just place. walked up and up smashed. That oh, wasn't yeah. enough though. He did it. He did it. Oh, no punish on the missed Phantasm too. Yeah, falling up air. Oh my. The chase! The chase from up air to up air! He did the thing! <laughs> Nexus unfazed right now, holding a slight lead with a stock. Yeah, I think like if, if Nexus didn't have the awakening um, previously, he definitely had an awakening last week. Yeah, that was probably the moment where he said, you know what, I can keep up with these top players. And you know, every time you beat one ranked player, it means you can beat another. Another, another, and exactly. then you're getting way better in the process, and then all of a sudden you are the ranked player, right? There you go. That's how it happens. It only starts with one. And speaking of one, you only need one up tilt for Nexus to really start the cutscene. Oh, even trapping the landing with another F smash. Second one, gonna whiff, but that's okay. Nexus still up a full stock. Oh, that's gotta be a punish. My that's gotta God. be a punish. Okay, Nexus illusioning back. Here we go. Ugh. Ooh. Oh! Oh! That didn't kill? <laughs> what? <laughs> that was so sick. Big backer, two stock from Nexus against the Mexican Invader. How will Chag respond? Uh, Good God. If I'm going to guess, Chag's going to run it back. I could see the run back. I could, I could see the run back. I could definitely see the run back. But, but not before we change the music. It won't. I think what's, what's important here isn't necessarily the stage. It's the gameplay. It isn't the gameplay. You're right. We did see like Chag doing a very good job of the way he was landing, especially whenever Nexus would try to go underneath Chag, making it so that the up tilt from Nexus wasn't an available option. Right. 
So I think like that incorporated with maybe being able to just you, uh, get rid of the, the laser pressure that Nexus puts out. You know, Tag will find himself in a good position. Up tilt. Yo, this song goes hard. What is this? Bro, Northern Cave has such a good song. <laughs> It's all that Final Fantasy music. Yep, Final Fantasy and Tekken, that's all you need in life. For, in terms of music for hype fight, like fight trucks, oh, they got you sure. covered. For sure. Whoa, <laughs> that killed! Yeah, back air so strong. That killed! Back air don't care! God! Why does every space see have a crack back air? I don't know. But don't let the Fox mains hear you, tell you, hear you say that. Was, that. was that a little bit of HBox DI or probably not? <laughs> probably a little bit. Okay, here we go. Yep, here starts the cutscene. Got up throw at a low percent. Just continuing the chase. The hunt from this bird is so impressive. This is this is this is the first match of uh, top 24 for Chag. Needs to make something happen here. They're fighting for a spot in top eight. Yeah, and still, you know, best top 24, only best of threes. You gotta win one more to make it to those best of fives. Oh. You know what, Tag realizes just how aggressive Nexus is playing at this point. If he can uh, close out the stock, then I think we're going to see a much different game. But closing out the stock against uh, such an aggressive player is going to be hard. Whoa, the residual hitbox, but of course it's softer with that up smash. That's true. Oh, there's the up tilt into forward air. Tag finds himself off stage again. And yeah, just the way that Tag's recovering, I really like it. It's not allowing Nexus to really apply any pressure because Chag just backs off to the point where if Nexus overextends, then he actually won't make it back. This time went for the back air again. It didn't kill, but neither did. Whoa! Drag down there, up smash. Mr. Nexus. Oh, here we go. You are a beast right now, the, man. The mid stock wave landings. That's when you know your player's popping off. He's feeling himself. Okay, that should be easy kill. Yeah. There we go. With that high of a percent, you're not going to have any little to no invulnerability on those ledges. Chag. Really wow. making use of that. You know, I'm I'm just impressed as hell right now. Ra uh, Chag looks like he has no answers whatsoever to this. Just I'm getting not. little hits here and there, but Nexus is getting entire like motion pictures on this man. Okay, yeah, you did. He is in fact, you know, Falco really those character one of those characters where he gets one hit definitely leads into like seven, eight, possibly even ten. But now that he's at eighty percent, this is where we're really gonna start seeing those illusions to back airs, up tilts to back airs, and Chag knows it. Look at the way that he's playing. He's throwing up forward airs to space to beat the delusions, using the invulnerable back airs. He's just not going to allow Nexus to get in with that easy confirm. It really won't. Okay. Ooh. Wanted that, but it's going to trip for the back air. No. This time he's not going to die, but he has only one shot left. Good God. Nexus wow. overtakes Chag. Oh, and a pop slight pop-off from Nexus. Let's go, Ooh. Nexus. <laughs> I love it, dude. I love it.